What's up beautiful? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name's Kat. This is my channel and it's another day and another haul. So I'm leaving for our annual Florida vacation with my in-laws in less than 72 hours. So of course, I have been saving these things and waiting to the last minute to do this haul for you guys, hoping that a few more things would come in the mail, but I had an order that was delayed from Set Active and an order that was supposed to be here today from Abercrombie that is also delayed. By the time you're watching this, I will already be in Florida, which is exciting. So uh, head on over to my Instagram to see my stories and watch our day-to-day -day over there. I will be vlogging as well as showing all of these outfits that I have purchased styled up. So if you like hauls and VSG content and lots of other fun things, be sure to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up and let's get into it. First off, I picked up two things at Zara. One of them I am going to try on, the other I'm not because it doesn't fit just yet. Um, so it's not gonna go with me, um, but the item that did fit is from one of the summer launches and it's this little kind of bib neck halter top in this really pretty purpley fuchsia color and it has shells on the bottom. I saw the ads for these items with shells on them and I had to purchase them. I got this purple top in a medium. It fits pretty well. I also have some Good Lines boob tape on its way to me. I hopefully, I hope that that comes before we leave. And then, and then I picked up from the same collection, the black dress. I'll pop up a photo of what it looks like on the model. It is so beautiful. It's just a little too tight in the hips. I did get this in a large, um, but I love the straps with the shell detail. So beautiful. I mean, neither of these things are particularly expensive. So I love Zara. The dress was 46 and the top was I think 30, 36. Yeah. So excited to take the purple one on my trip with me. There will also be a pack with me video, I think coming this week. I can't remember what order I'm going to put things in, but be sure to subscribe so you don't miss when that video comes out. So funky pants have been a super big trend lately and I have always wanted palazzo pants, but I have never been able to wear them because my waist to thigh ratio has always been so far off that by the time I got things that fit my waist, they were way too tight in the thigh and then the pants weren't flowy the way they're supposed to be, but I have officially lost enough weight that I can wear palazzo pants and I got two pairs. So the first pair I picked up from a little local boutique. They are so comfortable. I wore these the other day um, to take some meetings in at my house because they're it was a Zoom meeting, so nobody saw. They are, what brand? GGO USA, and they are in a size large. These are so great, and I'm really excited to take these on the trip. They're so comfortable. They feel like you're wearing pajama pants. I believe they were $35, so pretty good price. And I really love them. They have an elastic waist as well as a tie up. So as my waist gets smaller, I can tighten this a slight bit, which is really great. So this next pair of pants, I didn't actually purchase myself. They were given to me by my mother. Um, they are from Soft Surroundings and they are the most perfect tropical palazzo pants I have ever seen in my entire freaking life with their beautiful tropical Print. They've got monsteras on them. We did a closet clean out for my mom and she pulled these out and she's like, these don't fit me anymore, but you can try them on and they fit me pretty well. They are lined. Um, so they have a beautiful satiny interior. Of course, all of it is polyester according to this. This is from, did I say soft surroundings? And they are in a size medium. Shut up. Wow. So Super excited to take these on the trip. They are so, so beautiful. If I was like a classy lady going through the airport, this is the kind of thing I would wear like going through the airport, you know what I mean? But mm, we're not classy. We're gonna be wearing bike shorts and a hoodie. That's what's gonna happen. So as soon as I found those pants, I knew I needed to get some basics to go on top. And of course I have um, my Skims cotton tank tops and I've got some cute cotton tank tops from Abercrombie, but I have been super into Brahmies lately. So I had to try the original Brahmie from Classy Network. I've seen these all over Instagram and I had to just shut up and buy them. I bought four of them when they launched their first collection. Um, their first official collection, the summer collection, a couple of weeks ago, and I sent three of them back. 
So I did the size chart and I got larges and the large, I mean like, I got the large white halter and it does fit and I do like it, but I got the regular pads in it instead of getting the extra large pads. The regular pads do not work. You can clearly see them. They looked absolutely stupid, so ridiculous. Um, I do like the top, it does fit me pretty well. The large halter, I got another halter in green, but the color was not the same as it was on the website. So I sent that back. And the other two that I got were just way too small. So I would suggest sizing up. I don't know. Uh, I don't know if I'm gonna be too tempted to purchase from them again. I do really like this, but the fact that the pads were wrong and the sizing was just so screwed up does not entice me to shop there again. So, but I do like this and I will be wearing it probably with just pasties. It's tight enough that I don't particularly think I need different pads or anything to go inside of it. Um, but I think this will be perfect to wear with probably the green pants is what I'm gonna do. Next up, I took to Instagram to ask you guys where to get bikinis because I wanted some and I wanted some last minute and you would not believe the amount of people that told me to shop Shein. So I've never shopped there before and I gave it a shot and I think I sent 75% of it back. Now, normally I would save all my packages, show you the stuff that I sent back, but you're hearing me say I sent a bunch of things back without showing you in this round and that's mostly because um, I needed to send the stuff back before I got out of town. Normally I would show you everything, but I got a few accessories, and one shirt and one swim top that I did keep. So the two accessories, or the, well, one of them was a set. It's an anklet set. I wanted a little like string anklet that doesn't have any metal on it so it wouldn't like turn my ankle green getting in and out of the pool. So I got these two. This one's just stretchy and then this one's just regular string with shells. And I think these were $1.50. And then I also bought a pair of sunglasses they came in this nice case. I was actually pretty impressed with Shein. The, the, I mean, the shipping was super fast. The returns were super easy and didn't cost me anything. I just put it in my mailbox and like it went back. Um, it even came with a little cleaning cloth, which is crazy. So these are the sunglasses. I think they're really cute. They're very on trend right now with the little tortoise shell. Not particularly my shape, but I think will look cute in photos. Like I wouldn't wear them like this. I think that looks ridiculous. This is not my shape, but I think like posed in a photo, they look pretty cute. So, and they were $4. Cannot argue with that. Even Amazon cannot compete with that. And then for the clothing I kept from my Shein order, I picked up this one shirt. I feel like this is gonna make my mom go cross-eyed, but I saw this on the model and it was really cute and it's very, very soft. It is not the material I thought it would be. I thought it'd be kind of like a heavy cotton, um, but it's more of like a stretchy spandexy kind of a situation, but it is really, really nice. And I think it's gonna be fun for even Halloween. I don't know if I'm gonna take it on the trip, but um, you'll see in the pack with me if that's what I decide to do. I do really love the orange contrast stitching on the black side. I just think it's really cool. It's on the, the neck and the bottom. I don't know, I liked it and of course, not expensive because it's from Shein. And then the one bikini I got is this multicolor or dual colored one with the crisscross in the front. It's a little bit screwy because it got kind of twisted. I got this in an extra large. It does have the ability to like ruche up and down and it does have pads in it. And I think I might actually leave the pads in it, which is kind of crazy. I usually rip those suckers out as fast as possible, but I really liked this. Um, the other swimsuits that I got, the bottoms mostly didn't fit and a couple of them, the tops, there was just no way in hell. So I probably still needed like, I ordered larges and extra larges. That's my fault. I should have ordered all the plus size bikinis. So next up, I got one item from Revolve. I had a dress that I ordered and it didn't fit. So I sent that back, but I have one item that I kept and it is this little toiletry case and it is so cool. Um, I, I saw another YouTuber use this. I think it's, her name is, um, Sierra Furtado and I don't know if I'm pronouncing her name right. It's still got some thingies and I'm going to have to, still got plastic things holding the zipper closed so I can only get one side open, but it comes with this really nice mirror that stands up, which I thought was neat. 
little travel mirror and it has two sides and it is clear so you can see what is going on in there. I super appreciate that. And it's just a completely different shape than any of the other toiletry bags that I've ever had and my stuff fits in it way better. So super happy to have this. Okay, next up, I wanna talk about today's sponsor. Merit Beauty was kind enough to send me their entire collection minus the highlighter that was sold out. Um, but of course you guys know, I only work with brands that I love and I am not paid a penny for this. I just got the products to try to review for you guys and to provide my honest opinion. So they sent them in this really cute little bag which I've never seen packaging like this before. Their entire makeup collection is seven pieces. Again, I was only able to get six pieces, so I was able to snag the lip oil, the blush, the blending brush, the concealer foundation stick, the brow gel, and the mascara. It's a really interesting company. They focus on the body, the skin, and the planet. And the idea is that you have a handful of products and that's all you need. You just kind of have the basics and you can use them for multiple functionalities. Everything is clean and vegan. All of their packaging is recyclable. The general idea is minimalist beauty, less is more, and that you can do your makeup in five minutes because you have all of your products right in front of you. So I tried all of these products for you guys. I'm wearing a few of them today. I am a big fan of the eyebrow gel. I think it is comparable to some of the big name brow gels, the tinted brow gels. This stuff is really cool. And the packaging is just so beautiful. I'm also absolutely in love with this blending brush. It's exceptional for the cream bronzer as well as the little foundation stick. I will say the foundation stick is a little bit on the dry side for me. I have dry skin, so I kind of need a concealer or a foundation with a little bit more liquid, but if you add kind of a moisturizer to your skin before using this product, that tends to help quite a bit. I think that the color choices that I picked are pretty great. And the lip oil is super wonderful. The lip oil is so moisturizing. Let me just go ahead and put this on for you guys. There's no crazy fragrances or anything that's gonna irritate your skin. So let me just pop this on so you guys can see. It feels so nice. Like I am all into the lip oil game. I have been ordering them like crazy. And I think the color payoff is great. It's nothing insane. And all of these have like little click lids. I don't know how to explain that. Like you you screw the lids back on and then it clicks into place so you know the product's not gonna dry out and it's gonna stay fresh for a long time. I will leave a link to all of their products down below. Thank you so much to Merit for sending me these products to review for you guys for free in exchange for the products. All right, wrapping up this haul, we have two more stores. They are two of my favorites. So first off, we have Set Active. Like I said at the beginning of the video, um, I ordered from their vault and core collection drop and their production is way behind. It was supposed to be delivered a while ago and it still hasn't shipped. So I can't show you any of that, but I can show you the two orders that I got in the meantime. I got a lot of the same item in different colors because I'm obsessed with it and I've shown it in other hauls. So I'm just gonna show you one on me and then I'm just gonna hold the colors up for the rest of them. So my favorite bra from them is the Ribbed V bra. It looks like this. And they had kind of their like cocktail drink collection come out at the beginning of the month. And this one is in Sangria, I think. Is this one Sangria? No. This one is in Mojito. And then they had some of their core collection in stock as well. So I think this one was Sand. And I get these in a medium or a large, depending on what sells out first. The large is more comfortable, but the medium is better for like high intensity workouts. I also wear these as tops. I got it in black as well. And then from the cocktail collection, I also wanted to try the Y-neck bra from the Lux Form collection. I've never tried this before. I'm trying to hold it up and it doesn't wanna cooperate. This was the Lychee collection. Significantly different color than on the website, but you know, it is what it is. This bra is so nice. It holds you in so well and the fabric is just so buttery. I cannot wait till they come back out with the bike shorts in this fabric. They're sold out right now, but I am gonna snag some of those so fast. I also got the Y-neck bra in the Sangria color. 
super cute. Last week they did a collaboration with Way, the hair brand, and that just showed up yesterday. So it came in this little bag and I just left it in its little container because I thought it was adorable. So I got two items. And if you spent $89, you got this little set for free. And I'm actually gonna take these products, most of these products with me to the beach because they're perfect size. So it came with a little body and scalp scrub, a leave-in conditioner, I'm gonna take that with me, a hair oil, definitely taking that with me, and then a body cleanser. That's not enough body cleanser for the week, so I'm gonna leave this here. But, um, and then it came with this cute little pouch, which I love, and it also came with a coupon, but don't really need the coupon just yet. And then from the collection, I got two more of the ribbed V-neck bras. Oh, and I got another one that uh, you're gonna see in the try on haul that I'm wearing right now from the cocktail collection. I believe it's in Blue Lagoon. I cannot remember the names of these two Way collection colors, but I think they were like North Bond Street and Melrose Place possibly, maybe. I don't remember. I'll try to put the names up if I can find them. Um, so pink color, blue color, adorable, love these. I wear these like every day. And then what was cool about this collection was instead of the set logo, they put Way's name on there. And as always, my measurements are in the description below with the links to the products, but with set active products, usually they sell out within minutes of launching. So you're probably not gonna be able to get your hands on a lot of this stuff, but just so you know what the styles are, how much they cost and information on their website. I always link everything down below. All right, we are on to the last store, which is one of my favorite brands of all time. Farm Rio has quickly become a staple for me and they had a sale where it was like an additional 25% off, I think. They put stuff on sale and then they had a 25% off coupon. So I got two items and I'm so pumped. I always get a Lily Pulitzer dress before I go to Florida every year and this year I decided to get a Farm Rio dress instead. But before we get to the dress, I got one t-shirt. This ended up being $26, which is amazing. And I had had my eye on this for a while. It's this little toucan shirt so cute so tropical i got this in a medium i could have gotten a small it's very oversized they have some really cute t-shirts but lately they've been putting shoulder pads in them don't know why that's necessary um, but this one does not have them and i'm considering wearing this with bike shorts to the airport it is so soft their stuff is so well made and they plant a tree with every order which is just wonderful. And I don't know if they like spray everything with some kind of perfume before they send out the box, but the stuff smells so good. Like, I don't even know how to explain it. Like, it, the stuff just smells good, okay? And then this dress, I know it's not gonna be for everyone, but it is so beautiful. I think it's called the Mixed Prince Scarf Dress. Dark mixed print tiered dress. I got this in a size large. I would not say it's a perfect fit. It's a little, there's like some areas on the side of the boobs that it's a little bit loose in. But other than that, it zips up perfectly. The straps are so beautiful with their little delicate detailing with the beading. I just think that this is such a unique item. I will probably just wear pasties with this. It weighs next to nothing. So it's gonna, be really comfortable and flowy on the beach as well as not take up a lot of space in my suitcase, which I love. So I'm gonna have a hard time paring down what I'm actually gonna take with me. This dress was originally $245 and I think I ended up paying like 135 for it. So a really good discount, really good sale. And that's probably about what I would have spent at Lily Pulitzer. So I'm in love with this dress. This is one that as I continue to lose weight, I'm gonna have it tailored because it's just so beautiful. So there you guys go. I hope you enjoyed this haul. Be sure to give it a thumbs up. Thank you again to Merit for sending me some beautiful cosmetics. I hope you guys will check them out in the description below and I'll catch you next time. Love you, Warrior Crew. Bye.